Hi everyone, this is Antonio Ayhan Ahmed. What kind of questions should I expect during my F1 visa appointment at the US consulate in my country? The questions can you know, vary actually. You might actually receive questions about your study plans. Like the consulate person could ask you, why are you going to the US? You know, what will you be doing there? What will be your major? And then uh, what is your plans to continue your education? What will be your plans, of course, after your education? And then, uh, so they may also ask to understand why you study the particular or why you want to study this particular education or mayor, which doesn't have any relation or any, you know, relation to your previous background, studies or your work to show. So that they try to understand most likely about your future plans or about your study plans to understand is this really bona fide study that you will be doing. They could ask questions about your choice of university actually. They can say to find out oh, so how many schools or colleges did you apply? How many of them actually have been with you? And how many schools did really reject you? And they may ask to see if you were in the US before or have you contacted those schools. So to understand how much you know you really have done work you know before you acceptance to the particular you know college or school. So that's also to show them whether you have a bona fide study reason or not. And of course, you know, if you say that you're going to admit it to school, they'll constantly ask about, you know, your academic capacity or capability or your credentials. They may ask for, you know, scores that you got from the test. It could be TOEFL or GMAT. They can want to know, you know, how was your previous GPAs. They may want to check to see how good your, your English is. And then they may, you know, ask how come you don't want to study in other countries like in Canada or, or UK, Australia, but why US? So questions could come from there too. Or you could have a questions about your financial status. They could want to know what is your monthly income. They may want to know what's your sponsor annual income. They may want to see to see, you know, how you're going to support or pay for your educational costs while you're in the US. So they could come with the questions about you or your financial sponsor to find out if you really financially, you know, uh, eligible to continue your studies in the US. Of course, the consulate person can ask your plans after your studies. They may want to know if you have anyone, any relative or any friends living in the US. They may want to know your plans after this, you know, graduation. They may want to have your plans. What will happen? You know, do you plan to return back to your country? So they could come with several questions to understand what's your goals after your studies and to understand that before they issue you, you know, your F1 visa.